Hello. So hubby and I are hurrying up to get DMV stuff done because it's the last day of the month. Anyways, and then we gotta go back to the house because this guy's gonna buy our fridge and then we're gonna go back to the office and work tonight, so yay. All we do is work, 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 work. Stop. All right, so it's 6.10, we made it home. Um, and here's the fridge. Almost empty, it just has some water bottles, that's it. But everything else is in there. Do we have any other inserts? No, right? I think we did everything, okay. Perfect, it's going. Cool. Oh, he's here. Yay, it's going. All right. Nah, she's fine now, babe. Because we're coming back home. It's one more thing gone. He's good. And now I have this stuff. So what we were doing was um, putting drinks in the downstairs fridge here, like extra beverages. And I feel like, we, one, we already have a big enough fridge for like all this stuff. And two, we don't need to be buying extra. You know what I mean? Hey guys, what's going on? I was just gonna do a quick little haul from Ikea. Um, we bought a comforter and we also bought a chair cover. And I'll show you those at the end. Um, but let me go ahead and share the things that we bought right here. So just a few things we picked up. Soap dispenser for the guest bathroom and nickel finish. We got that. I picked up a couple of these just white pillowcases, you know, and I thought this would be good because sometimes my husband, um, his gets kind of not really nice because he puts gel in his hair and yeah. So I just feel like I'll just throw them away if, you know, he likes these. So I'm gonna try them out and see what he thinks of them. Got a toilet brush cleaner. This is for the office. And then picked up a couple, a couple white pots and I thought, and we have a white duck, <laughs> and I got this one too. I decluttered, and I also got rid of all of our like big plate, the, the plate set and stuff, if you guys watched that. So I needed some new plates, and I wanted something that was lightweight and white, and something that will just be easy, you know what I mean? But this one has like, things will spill out and stuff, so, and it's a good size. So we got six of these, and then six of the dinner plates. And they're perfect, I just love them. So I'm excited to get these all washed up. And also we picked up a couple of these. Now you're probably like, okay, TJ, why are you picking up containers? But I love this because there's one, they're stackable. Two, they're all white. Three, they're storage. And four, I love it that this also becomes like, um, like a little tray. I don't know, I just thought that's cool. Or storing whatever. Um, and you could put a label on it. They're nice, they're clean, they're simple. And yeah, that just fell. Okay, picked up a couple toilet brushes and these came in their own container and so I'm gonna put one in our master and one in the guest bathroom. So that was everything from Ikea. So let's go upstairs and I'll show you the two things. Now we have this yellow chair and it's, you know, not really nice. But I got a cover for it because Chloe sleeps in there, so we'll see how it looks. And after, so much better. Look at that. It's like, I know it's so wrinkly, but I just want to make sure it fits. Okay, so much better than that. That yellow. I'm just trying to knock the yellow out. So here is the bedding, just a comforter. It's super nice. It fits really well. I love how it fits the bed on both sides here. And it's very very nice all right and then also the chair right here um just to make it white and there's chloe showing you her is that chloe's bed where is chloe sleep at it's kind of hard for her to get in though honestly um so i may have to do something here because see how this one is open so she has a hard time getting in and out um and I don't want her to get stuck in there. No, baby. No, 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 no. We're not biting it. Sorry. Okay, so, and it's a little bit big, but I still like the white in here. Um, yeah, so that is that. I just chill and... What? Oh. Yes, she has to... Ow! Hey! Are you serious? You better stop. She just gets so crazy. How come you so crazy? Ow! 
Hey, stop. Stop it. Stop. Stop it. I don't know what gets into her sometimes. Like, all of a sudden, like, just random. Look, and now she's going to jump down and go somewhere and go do something else. Good morning. Okay, so on my side over here by the door, we have this little thing. I originally got this to um, put in the, um, like, the foam piece to put in the office. But I don't know. I don't really like it. And then this gray, it's just a curtain that I bought for two bucks. And it's good and everything, but I don't know if I want it on here on the floor like this. Because I really, really am loving, like, whites that have been added in or the light colors. And so, that's that white chair from Ikea, the cover. And then on the sofa here, I still like this one out. The one with the white heart. So, I still like that one to be out there. And then this one, um... I think I'm gonna it was on our bed before but now I'm gonna use it on that mat so let's switch it out and I'll show you what the gray and white what the difference looks like here sorry I'm vacuuming and cleaning up and stuff so okay so there's the before and I'll show you what it looks like after good thing I moved it look at what's crawling out look at that is that a black baby black or no I don't know and I don't care and I'm gonna vacuum it up <laughs> Okay, uh, sorry buddy. Okay, and after. So much better than that. So I'm going to take that out. And I'm just going to finish vacuuming. Then this is going to go. Very good. Yay. I love it. <laughs> Hello. Here's my eye. I don't know. I like washed it with a cold washcloth. And if you look really closely, I don't know, it's like, it's like swollen, but at least it's going down. But the whole orbital, like, I don't know, this whole thing was hurting, like, really bad. So I've been soaking it. Sorry about Chloe. Anyway, it's just uh, cleaning up. It feels good. So much easier to clean. And, I don't know, I just love it. And I just cleaned up all outside. Um, I just swept up everything out there and so yeah that's all clean and we're ready for the weekend because today is Friday it's Friday <laughs> anyways it just feels like so relaxing I can't explain the feeling to you but it's so amazing like you wake up in the morning and it's like I don't know things are easier when I go in the shower everything is like what I use is there and um, I get time to just take time to just chill out on these things that's why I have this thing because I like to open the window but yeah I like chill with you know little Chloe girl there she is on the floor Chloe girl oops okay fail Sorry. Okay, anyways, let me finish vacuuming. In there, in there, and then we'll come back out. Oh, perfect timing. I am making dinner. And I'm roasting some vegetables here. A baby zucchini and carrots and mushrooms. I think I'll let them go for another 10 minutes this way. And then Mmm. Mmm. Not so good. Okay. Sorry, my kitchen is an absolute mess, but, um, here's hubby's. Mmm. Chicken pot pie. Let's put some more because it's helped so much. Chicken pot pie, roasted vegetables, mashed potatoes, and yeah. Thanks for watching. Bye. And we just got done eating, so I know the kitchen is a mess, but it's gonna have to wait because this stuff we can do at the end and now because it's trash day tomorrow so put on my boots and some gloves and uh get the trash stuff done huh <laughs> which one this. oh yeah that one is trash so need to dump it. anyways this one definitely is going in the trash this whole thing is trash because it's like 
really rotted out. What we're gonna do this one, we're gonna transplant, and that is gonna go back on the deck. So, yeah, and then this is the new paint color and the new roof color. So we need to put all this stuff in the garage and then take out the old roof color, old paint colors and all that. So yeah, it's a process, but it's getting done little by little. <laughs> okay, let's do this real quick. We're gonna put a pot in, a plant in here and in here and here we're tr transplanting three of them. So I gotta help my husband. Hold up. Or are you gonna just take it out? I say you just take it out, yeah. So you're gonna hand them to me. Chloe, watch out. No, 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 baby. No, no, no. Back up, back up, back up, back up. Good girl. Thank you. Very good. It's all good. Because it's the only day we have. And here is our first one that we need to transplant. See what I'm saying? It's. The pot is so small for it now. I know. It's loose, but it's. The, the dirt in there is very dry. I'm just saying, if you have to break it, break it. You know, break the pot if you have to. It might be easier. I mean, we've had that pot for what, 10 plus years? Oh, well, see, look, it's loose. It's see? loose? Did you loosen the dirt around it? No. First, loosen the dirt around it with the shovel. The shovel won't fit in there. Oh, okay, let me do it then. Okay, so I took the shovel, I loosened it up a little bit. Hubby put it down and then turn the pot, hit it, turn the pot, turn the pot and then loosened out and put some dirt in here so now he's gonna transplant that over. So hopefully everything goes well. Um, he said it should come out in one thing now. And he's absolutely correct. Cool. Yeah, that's how it's gonna be. All right, I gotta fill it up with, you hold it in the middle, yeah, I fill, fill some it. dirt right there. Okay. Okay, so this one is done with. It looks so good. I love it. We watered it and we put some um, mulch on top, some wood chips kind of thing. So that's done and then we just cleaned up over here. That goes over there. That's gonna go as well and then that's gonna go. So these two pots are gonna be going and then that ladder is not ours. So we'll be good to go. Yay, I love it. And I have two more to do. And so one pot down, so this one is out and this one came in and now I have two more to do. Okay, here's my pot selection. That doesn't sound right. My pots, my planting pot selection. So here's the plant. Now I don't know if I wanna transplant it into this pot or in that one. See how they're two different. Mm, I don't know, I feel like this one is already so busy. I might put in that one. It was in there. But what I learned about transplanting, because I did a quick little, you know, search. Uh, if you're transplanting in something that's too small, you want to make sure that it's only one to two inches in diameter, bigger than its original container. I was going to put it in here. Well, this one would have been even probably worse because it's smaller. So this is gonna be good for it. And, uh, but I don't know, I feel like this one is a little too busy. So, let's see. And I shouldn't be doing it on top of here, but really, I can't see it, you know, unless you, and I don't wanna redo things, so I just rather will take the time to do this right now. See what I'm saying? Yeah, I already like that better. I already like that pot better than that. Okay, and then that one, is gonna house this plant. See how this one is like overly dry. It's growing nice, but it just needs to be transplanted into a better pot. Um, and then we'll get rid of that one too. So yeah, we're gonna do some more potting. Are you right here? Yeah. Okay, so here is the, the big one. And here's that one that was in that mug looking one in there. So now it is in here and it looks really nice sorry it's a little bit messy down there and then this one got planted in this one so i love it and then that one is going to go and then the other one that was in there as well is going to go to that one in there this one is staying outside this one will be inside and inside this one we've had since it was baby baby and then it even died at one point because we couldn't take care of it. This was in 2004 and then it's come back to life and 
it's gone with us in every home we've lived in so yeah i'm gonna stop talking thank you for being here hey guys today i am working on the kitchen i've already done the purge now so this is all stuff that i need to clean and things that i'm left with and things that i love or things that i bought or things that i've had for the kitchen or whatever so, um hubby's gonna help me i don't know why i'm showing you that but before i can get there i need to do dishes and i thought it'd be great if he could just help me and we just had like a little system going on and so um we could wash everything and i'll wash all the plates and the little plates and everything out these guys and of course our stuff in all these and also these and yeah so here we go first things first fill up some water next up make sure you clean the counter place something down to where you're gonna put the dishes gloves on sponge out and let's start Okay, anyway, they're to stop because hubby is taking off all the labels for me. Um, if I continue washing in hot, hot water with that label remover and it's working out great. Cool, without scratching anything. Awesome. Alright, and then that, and then we have those, and then that's, oh, and then we have a couple more jars and that one. Oh, and this stuff, so we still have a little bit more. Okay. We are done! Look at all the glassware! Everything is washed with nice hot water, sanitized, and it is hot, but thank you to Hubby who helped me dry everything. I'm so happy we have new stuff and everything brings me joy and it's wonderful to wanna use everything and yes, and letting go of these, um, don't need them. You know, I've saved so many of them. Ikea candle holders, they can go, yes. Woo! I hope this inspires any of you guys out there to do this, do it with your partner, help them. It's amazing. All right, sorry I look like crap as always, but whatever. I just filled sugar, salt. These are, these are not the permanent labels. I just took up the other labels um, because I am like, it was in these plastic ones. So these I'm gonna go ahead and discard, discard, discard. Well, these I'll get rid of that. It goes in the recycling. And then this is rice. So I got that and discarded this, another bag. So all this will be going. And then these things right here, I'm gonna keep out on the counter and exactly for stuff like this instead of us having like you know sitting in the bag and fill this in there Ooh, yeah. see these are really good size mm -hmm. Roasted, unsalted, whole cashews, yummy. And now, I put this on, and then this will go into the recycle. And because this has a seal, they are also airtight. See that? And then, well, I think maybe I'll put it on that side, but. And then when we wanna eat it, just get it. 